gotta sit on a towel because the seas froze. Let me get positioned here. Ooh, 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 look at that. That MB gear, you know what I'm talking about? We're gonna talk about how the Strike King Takeover Monster Bass Box is the most valuable subscription box of all time. And I'm not talking, you know, 40 bucks. I'm not talking 50 bucks. I'm talking mm, $300,000. I'm talking there's one lure in here worth $300,000. What if I told you? What if I told you this box had $500,000 of value to it. What if I told you this box had a million dollar value? Well, that's what we're gonna talk about today. Let's get right into it. Let's go. Okay, everybody, let me jump in here real quick. We do have a giveaway going on. The last video is a $150 giveaway. All you gotta do is subscribe and comment on that video. We're gonna pick a random person in the comments that'll win $100 of lures, and then another random comment will win $50 of lures. I'll send it to you, ship it out for free, all that good stuff, of course. So go to the last video, make sure you comment and you're subscribed right here on the Shell Outdoors channel. On this video, comment your favorite Strike King lure, whatever it might be. I don't care if it's a hard bait or a soft bait or a jig of some kind, comment your favorite Strike King lure below. We already have another giveaway planned out. I went out and got a super nice tackle box and I'm actually gonna fill it with a bunch of lures and we're gonna give that away. So make sure you're subscribed right here and then go check out the Monster Bass channel. They are fueling a lot of my videos these days. So make sure you check out Monster Bass. Let's get into this video. Make sure you're subscribed and check out all the social medias. Let's go. So I started thinking about how Strike King is attributed to the winning and earnings of so many tournaments. I mean, in this box alone, let's, in this box alone, the J. Lee comeback jig was designed after Jordan Lee won the 2017 Bassmasters Classic. And the first day he only had like eight pounds, second day was like 21 pounds, third day was like 28 pounds. Obviously a phenomenal comeback for Mr. Lee. Then he went on to win the 2018 Bassmasters Classic. He won $300,000 in one tournament in 2017, won it again in 2018 and won another $300,000. His total career earnings is 1.6 million. So you wanna talk about a lure worth some money? $300,000 tournament, one tournament on the line, $300,000. He wins it twice, makes $600,000. Total career earnings, 1.6 million. <laughs> and then I started thinking about the Red Eye Shad. The Red Eye Shad, Red Eyed Shad is one of my favorite lures of all time. And I'm not talking just because Dick Sporting Goods listed it as one of the top lures of 2020. And I'm not talking about because TripSavvy.com listed it as one of the best baits of all time one of the top eight baits of all time. I'm not even talking about those reasons. Early 2020 at Lake Gunnersville Bassmaster Tournament, Brandon Lester won seventh place and attributed it to the Red-Eyed Shad. That was a $22,000 payout. Same tournament, second place. Todd Austin took home $50,000, over $50,000, actually about 53, and attributed it to the Red-Eyed Shad. That made me think, man, that is a lot of money from one tournament. That's $70,000, $75,000 in one tournament attributed to the success of the Strike King Red-Eyed Shad. And I started thinking to myself, man, Monster Bass has given us the hookup. Who knows how much money could be attributed to the lures in these boxes. Now, it's not only Strike King lures in this box, it was actually a double takeover box with Strike King and BioBait. And we'll get into all these lures at the end real quick. But let's look at how much money could be made on Strike King lures. Now I got some numbers here, and this ain't even all the numbers. This is just what I came up with after a couple hours of research, digging stuff up online. If you're somebody who wants to be a professional fisherman, or if you're somebody looking into getting into the fishing industry, this should be crazy motivation for you. All right, Bassmasters, Arkansas River, Strike King lures were attributed to the second place spot fifth place, eighth place, ninth place, 10th, 11th, 12th. So out of the top 12 spots, this is the payouts to people who attributed Strike King lures as their success. 22,000, 11,000, 9,000, 7,000, six, five, five, five. That's $70,000 attributed to Strike King lures 
at the Arkansas River 2020 Bassmaster Tournament. And then I thought, well, what about MLF? I love Major League Fishing. Toledo Bend 2020. Strike King Lures took second place, fourth place, eighth place, and 10th place for 15,000, 9,000, 5,000, 3,000 a $32,000 payout. That's just in the top 10. That's just in the top 10. There was other competitors. MLF, Lake of the Ozarks 2020, took third place and sixth place, 10,000 and 7,000, $17,000 just in the top 10. So then I got real curious and I wanted to see what lures are people using? Who is winning these tournaments? I went back to the 2017 MLF first place finishes by people who attributed their wins to Strike King Lures and a whole bunch of them are the Red Eye Shad, but let's look at some. In the FLW Tour on Lake Gunnersville 2017, Mark Rose won first place, $125,000. Attributed it to the Red Eyed Shad and a jig. The very next tournament, Lake Travis, Mark Rose won again another $125,000 and attributed it to Strike King Lures, a jig and uh, the Rage Bug and the Squadron Head. But just in two tournaments, he won $250,000 in Strike King Lures. Monster Mass is giving you a takeover box full of these types of lures. $250,000, that's one person. Then the FLW Tour on the Potomac River was won by Tom Mansoor he attributed it to the Menace Grub, the Strike King Menace Grub, hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> the the Costa series or Costa, whatever you say, on Sam Rayburn, Todd Castledine attributed his success to the KVD Square Bill Rage Bug and the Anaconda Rage Tail, fifty thousand dollar first place payout. The Lake of the Ozarks Andre Dick Knight Rage Craw, forty thousand dollar first place payout. These are Strike King lures. College Tour. 2017 College Tour, Kentucky Lake, Dylan True and Matthew Lamastis won $55,000. These are college kids winning 55 grand on the Series 5, the KVD 2.5, Rage Lizard, and the Shadowlicious. All Strike King lures. $500,000 in first place wins just for the MLF Tour on Strike King lures. Just between the 2017 first place finishes, $500,000. And, on, uh, and that's just MLF. And then Jordan Lee's 2017 and 2018 first place finishes with the Bassmasters. You're talking a million dollars. A million dollars of wins. And that is a very narrow spectrum of tournaments. That's not even everything. Let's look at what else we got in here. So have we talked about the Jay Lee comeback jig, the Red Eye Shad. They also give you the Strike King Sugar Buzz. Look up the Sugar Buzz and look at a bunch of the videos they made about it. People are throwing it in 40 degree air temps. Top water is not dead just because it's cold. It's dead here because I have ice. <laughs> Strike King, KVD. This is a flat sided crank. This is the 1.5 flat side. You get a picture of my boy just tossing bass. I don't know how he's catching so many fish. The dude's amazing. And then we get some bio baits in here, right? We get a bio bait leech. We get a bio bait stick bait. We get a bio bait fluke style. And some Daiichi. Daiichi? I don't even know how to say it. Tell me how to say it in the comments. Daiichi hooks. I could be out here for days telling you how much money these lures could make you. But only you can go out and throw them. Only you can get these boxes, go out and try them. Make sure you comment your favorite Strike King lure below if you are somebody who wants to make money fishing. If you're somebody who wants to learn new lures, if you're somebody who wants to expand your fishing knowledge, take a look at the Monster Bass boxes. Take a look at the lures that Monster Bass is putting in their boxes. Thank you so much for being here. Make sure you comment your favorite Strike King lure below. Make sure to get in on our giveaway so we can give you some free stuff and just hang tight. If you're in the Midwest with me and you got ice on the water, but it's not thick enough to go ice fishing, just hold tight, just hang on. Dig through your tackle, sort it out, watch fishing videos, watch the Monster Bass channel, and be ready for spring. Peace.